AL.com, thanks for joining us. And it's about that time. It's the Halloween season. Yep. Mia Watkins and Edward Bowser is here to count down the five worst affronts to Halloween, the worst candy in trick-or-treat history. If you love the children, please don't give them this candy. Please, please, please. So first up, we have the Black Death of Candy. My gosh. Licorice. It's awful. It's waxy. It's horrible. Don't give people that if you love them. Or even if you don't love them, don't give them to them. Number two on our list, circus peanuts. They don't taste like peanuts. What do they even taste like? Have you ever chewed on a styrofoam cup? Tastes like that with like a hint of orange, a zest of orange. You're eating styrofoam, people. Why even? And next, we have probably the most recognizable, yet most horrible candy of Halloween. Candy corn. I'm sorry if you like this. I'm going to apologize on your behalf for your bad taste. It is an affront to God. And I'm sorry. You need to repent. This is basically all I have to say about candy corn. Number four. You, I don't even know what the name of these things are. This, you've seen those things that are like wrapped in black and orange waxy paper? Are they peanut butter? It's like Satan himself dug his earwax out and wrapped it up in Halloween themed paper. What is that mess? And why do they continue to exist every year? And finally, let's just get rid of any and all grandma candy. And what I mean by grandma candy are peppermints, butterscotch, Wurzels Originals. If your grandma gives you this candy at church to keep your breath fresh, don't put it in the in the baby's pumpkins for Halloween. This is not to enjoy. That's medicine. So that's what we hate. What do you hate? What kind of Halloween candy burns your cheese? Let us know in the comments. And please have a happy Halloween. And do the children right. Think of the children, please. Think of the babies. They're our future. Yes. Happy Halloween. See ya.